Coach, uh, team gutted out a 4-3 win today. Great to get back in the win column. Yeah, it seems like it's been a long time. Uh, long, it seems longer than it has been, to be honest with you. But I, I'm so happy for these guys. You know, we've gone through some tough times. And, and as a coach that's, uh, that's coached for a while, I knew, you know, coming over here, this is never an easy atmosphere to play, play in. We've had some real dog fights over here. And last year we came out on the short end, and I knew it wasn't going to be easy, and it wasn't. It came down to the time run at the plate. Um, I'm very happy with the way the pitching responded in a midweek game. Uh, we didn't give up uh, very few, if any, free passes. And, uh, you know, we gave up two solo home runs, but that doesn't beat you most of the time when you, when you don't have multiple runners on base. Talk about about the, the pitching today. Pitch out of a number of big jams, especially Trevor Sharpie there in the, the sixth, I believe. Well, you know, I, you know, I, I'm, I think they're waiting to, to finally – continue to, to grow up and get better and, and hopefully you know this game's all about confidence and I'm hoping that every guy that ran out there today who actually did his job Sabe struggled a little bit but he's a veteran um, can re can carry this into the next series and continue it on for the rest of the year I mean this game is about confidence and I know there's there's a lot of guys that pitch today that are getting on the bus and heading back to Knoxville that are feeling happy about their performance talk about the decision to change up the defense a little bit to start the game well, we're searching. Uh, you know, I know defense wins, and uh, you know we're trying to find some solutions to, to why we're not running down some balls. You know, unfair to Will. You know, he's he, he fights through everything, and and uh, but he just doesn't have he hasn't had as much reps out there. And he got to some balls, and just his angles weren't as good. And on that ball that he hit to the wall, he didn't get all the way to the wall. So we're 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 searching. I mean, we're we're uh, you know we're not we're not just grasping at straws. We're trying to put good athletes in the right spot. And then uh, what does this do for, you, for the team's confidence hanging up to Lexington this weekend? Well, you know, it's, it's how we come back and practice tomorrow and Thursday when we get to Lexington. I mean, this is a midweek game. It's a win. It's a good win, especially when you dropped as many as we have um, in a row. And, and uh, we've just got to continue to keep building. But I, I could see that the happiness and, and the, the jubilation after the last out was reported when they were shaking hands. And that makes you feel good as a coach because I know how hard it's been on these guys, just like it's been on the coaching staff. And it feels good to... To get back, you know, to get back on the bus and feel good about what you accomplished today. Thank you.